this is Madeline Paterno. I just wanted to return your call from yesterday. Well, we're continually see, setting up, so uh, it's just all action go at the moment. But we'll see you then on the 22nd. Look forward to meeting you. Living in London inspires me in the sense that I feel at home in London. And because I feel at home and because I feel comfortable in London, I'm able to just go out every day and paint. I'm not one of these artists that gets inspired by nature. I really get a kick. I just get a kick out of creating. And I mean, I really can't pinpoint. It's just, it's kind of silly. It's like being a little kid. It's like, yeah, I can make what I want to make. It's just really, it's a mind trip. I, I love it. Watch, watch this side, don't worry about the legs. The naked lady on the table. Basically, I just thought, what a play on words, you know. I have so many prints that I've called dressed for dinner. And I just thought, what better thing than having a nice naked lady sprawled across the table with her neck just ending where somebody could be sitting. And, you know, some nice guy sitting at the other end, getting a nice, you know, sight of a little bikini. I have to flip it over. Yeah, maybe, um... Oh, oh shit! It's the drawer, it's okay. Okay. Still just getting all the stuff actually in the gallery. You said 12 o'clock before. Okay. Okay, well, I guess uh, <laughs> she'll just see it in chaos. That's okay. Yeah, all right, that's fine. Well, well, we'll be waiting for her then. Okay, great. Thank you, bye. Oh, well. I've left my marks on the pavement. <laughs> Whoopsie. Oh, can somebody answer that? I just can't even write anything right now. I'm standing in the street with my hands wet. Perfect. Well, see you, see you Thursday. Um, well, I look forward to seeing you. <laughs> okay, bye. Now, I only seem to have on me, which I hope is okay, they're for the 22nd of January because I'm having two opening nights. Or do you have for the 21st? Okay, great. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna, I'll see how I hang them. It really depends if I put them in threes, but some go better together than others. For instance, these two, they're an odd number anyway. But I'm gonna see how I hang them. I was planning on probably putting them on this wall here. And then I have all these beautiful big fly arrangements that are coming in, so it's gonna really look quite... Um, you got any more invites? Yes, me? yep, I do. I've got the 21st. I can get some more. Um, to you, I, I sent some earlier to your yeah, office. No, yeah. Them, uh, okay. More, well, okay. I might have some. Wait, where is my backpack well, downstairs? Them, yeah. Well, I'll just take you downstairs, and I'll just show you. I think I have somewhere in my backpack. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you. Yeah, this is actually goes this way. Has that slightly Moroccan feel. Yeah. 
And I have these photographed images of myself when I was in Morocco wearing the veil. Absolutely brilliant. Okay, so what time do you want me here again? If you come at seven and then you can go around the exhibition and then you'll see it properly and around 7.30, okay. but don't worry, it's not anything. <laughs> not anything major needs to be said, okay. other than uh, it's more about interior design and a young artist who's putting the two together, and it's you know, something that's interesting, and it's something that I'm going to pursue anyway. Mm -hmm. And I'm with this um, documentary trying to get more shows in New York and doing this type of thing, so. Uh, Great. Yeah. OK. Wonderful. Well, I will see you on Wednesday. And Excellent. Call me I will. Call my office, so OK. Okay. Um, I just tell her that I'm going to get her to come anyway. All right. But, uh, if you've got any more of these. Yes, I'll, I'll drop some off at your office um, probably tomorrow morning or okay. tonight. Yeah, try tonight and do that. OK, right. excellent. Thank yeah. you. Bye. Money, she's gone. <laughs> she liked it. <laughs> she went. She liked it. She said, <sighs> oh, they're wonderful. <laughs> How do I see myself in life? Ooh, this is a very big question for a little artist like myself. I still have not figured that. I am a very, I mean, I'm not afraid to say this, but I am a very insecure person, <laughs> especially about myself. I really am. It might not seem like it. I hide it well, years of training, but I still don't know how I see myself, where I place myself. I'm definitely trying to create a respect for what I'm doing because I know that what I'm doing is valid, is valuable, adds something to other people's lives and I'm trying to create my space where I can show people that through my creativity I can, <gasps> I can still live and I can earn a living and I can do this and I enjoy it and it gives other people pleasure and it's, it's yeah. all my creation in my direction without having to justify yeah, 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 and yeah, place yeah, myself yeah, yeah, in, in that yes, ladder that well I've been taught I'm supposed to be part of. It's the best way of life. Hey, I think more that's people fine. should do what I'm that's doing. Fine. Yeah, that's all right. Every single canvas is, is like having a dialogue. If you start a canvas and you just have this dialogue, that's why these heads sort of move all, I mean, when I'm starting in charcoal, and I'm moving all over the place, all over the canvas, constantly redoing, redoing, change, 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 chopping the canvas, making it bigger, smaller, whatever. When it's really going well, your adrenaline is pumping. I am just flying, thinking, right, 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 right. Next, 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 next. I can't wait. I can't wait for this to be dry. I just can't wait to hang it up. I can't wait to step back and have a look at it again. And you're just, you're really like speeding away, painting away like mad and you know, every 15, 20 minutes, hanging it up once, you know, the shellac is more or less dry. Sometimes you don't even want to wait to, for it to dry and you get those nice runny dribbly bits that I, that's when I'm really impatient. <laughs> I just want to see it up on the wall. And um, no, it's, it's exhilarating. Oh, this thing is just not fucking working. I think I'm going to have to chop this off in half, right here. Oh.